Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Play with Asper Witch, where we are continuing our uh, carpet sieging of the Ottomans, uh, the foundation of our land bridge. We won the siege of Ankara. Let's uh, get uh, sieging over here as well. You know what? I'm gonna do the sensible thing here and uh, drop off one troop in each territory to prevent them from reinforcing. They will arrive. Oh well, they can't cancel by now. They can't. Then they shan't. There we go. Let's uh, leave that last one and uh, oh, no guy, fifteen thousand troops. Hmm, troublesome. Let's see now. There, 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 there. Let's do it like this instead. Attaching some sieges. Uh, you can actually stay there. You can hop out there. Okay. Things are happening. Yabal Shaman. Well. I don't really want more um, nationalism anywhere else, but I'm gonna leave them be for now because uh, potentially Tunisia or uh, Oman will try to attack attack them for me, and that will eat their troops instead of mine. Not a bad idea. We have won the siege of Konya and Karaman. And we'll leave these uh, peasants to Byzantium. Croatian patriots in Laika. Why am I having um, such high revolt risk? Oh yeah, what's the rebel sentiment I got from from being 108% overextended? That sucks. Uh, let's uh, do that for now. It was somewhere else as well, right? Or oh, Istria. 6 C power. That hurts. But I might as well. No one is going to take care of those rebels, so it's... Uh, it's gonna be trouble. Uh, we are getting a lot of peasants over here. Let's uh, leave that behind. We are winning sieges. Izmir is over there. Izmir. Influence or prestige? Or papal influence. Well, we have a mission to improve prestige, so let's do that. Alright. We are almost done with the Ottomans. Uh, we'll take a quick look at what uh, the cost of all of these provinces we want will be and if it's uh, lower than expected I guess we'll go on ahead sieging up uh, Oman to take a few provinces from them as well but I have a feeling that this will be more than we can pay for. Uh, Alright, nobles are plotting. We won the siege of Aleppo. That's over there. Laika is getting nationalism. Oh, oh well. So much for our prestige. So, 1550. 
and we are almost through Arabia. I am. Oh, Syria. National tax or one inflation? Uh, let's look at that. Taxation. Five ducats. Well, I'm gonna go with that. 1554. That's just five years. So, someone made Syria exist. Well, I want Terabulus, so yeah. Let's uh, let's not beat around the bush. That's that taken care of. Almost. Except for these rebels. They are making things trouble. Trouble them. Hmm. Syria has a really nice color. To be honest, that purple. Um, okay, let's. Uh, you know what? Let's get this guy up here, and maybe, or let's get that guy up there, and maybe uh, Byzantium will try to take care of the rebels instead. Let's get that guy there, and yeah. Ottoman peasants in Sivas. They're everywhere. I guess the Ottomans are having a bit of problem. A bit of trouble. Mm. Medina. Oh, it's the no Nogai troops mostly. Well, it might actually be worth just. Uh, Taking care of these um, peasants and uh, piecing out when we have 100% war score instead of uh, arguing over the rest of it. We'll see how much it will be for these uh, coastal provinces as well as Adern. Alright, making progress, making gains. I'm uh, very optimistic about our uh, Indian future. <sighs> well, I guess I won't be at 100% with uh, provinces uh, lost in... in sieges but uh, I think I'll have enough now I will be probably be at 99% um, yeah let's uh, help help them out Dal Kadir is left as well because this this should be the only thing they have let's see oh no let's not uh, Let's not leave this. Yemen. Well, that doesn't matter. Well, this episode is uh, not super exciting. <laughs> it's uh, This war is a bit too easy. Araqua, that's up here. Yeah. yeah, look, someone did take care of those rebels. Because they're not around anymore. We have won the Siege of Konya. Hmm, great. Let's uh, help them out with our siege ability then. There we go. Our siege ability of zero. Well, could be worse. And yeah, we could use our uh, chunks of admin power for a lot of coring, but uh, 10 years of nationalism less from the provinces we take is gonna be worth it. There we go. Stability cost modifier and time to justify trade conflict. Not that great if you ask me, but um, yeah, what, what the hell? Why not? So when we complete this, we will be getting our uh, galley 
my combat ability plus 50%. Well, the Venetian national ideas are not uh, super. They're not bad. But there's better, better ones out there. Uh, yeah, that's that leaves uh, Dolkadir. And let's uh, annex poor Syria. Well, actually, Syria has uh, a lot of claims. So we could easily just uh, vassalize them and... Uh, Yeah, let's do that. Let's actually do that. Uh, not offer tribute. Let's uh, let's vassalize you and feed you some provinces. But then, on the other hand, you are probably yeah, you are Sunni, so you should be made Catholic. So let's actually full annex you and spit you out instead. There we go. And we can't create vassals while at war. Well, no big deal. <sighs> I'll learn someday saying something else once in a while. But it won't be today. Byzantium taking care of business. Maybe I should uh, try to join in on that or something else. Try to get uh, my prestige up to 50 before I win this war. Mm, unlikely to happen, but uh, we can try. Fighting Oman, no guy. Well, Byzantium is taking care of it for me. Not much to do. Could start sieging uh, Oman, I guess, just in case. Just in case I need it. Nowhere for me to do business. Let's uh, step on them as well, then. Oh, we won't, but. Uh, There we go, Siege of Dolkadir. Uh, we didn't get 100% as I thought we would. I guess that's because it's... Yeah, I don't know. Perhaps they have some a province somewhere else. Uh, or is it because they have occupied other provinces? Oh well, let's, uh, uh, let's at least look at this. Oh, they moved their capital to Adana. Uh, let's return Edirne to Byzantium. Let us uh, hmm. let's see. Izmir. We want Karaman. We want Aleppo. And Dolkadir. That's one hundred and eighteen percent. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. So then what is gonna happen? I guess we are not getting Aleppo. Oh, Karaman. Karaman. Well, that would be equally expensive. <sighs> well, this was difficult. I could get those. And that. Would you, what do you think of that? I should try to get some. Um, hmm. I want to try to get. No, they, no, they're they are below two hundred percent. That means I could potentially take them into wars. So we need 99% war score. Uh, let's uh, let's get going then. 
Let's get these back. And let's see what we can do about that war score. Um, whoa. There we go. Netherlands declaring independence. So Austria go to war. It's not easy being Netherlands. Uh, spawning like this because you spawn with no allies oh well they're allied to France so uh, they have that oh yeah they're fine <laughs> I guess they're fine uh, how is France doing 52,000 troops 66 and Austria is at 61,067 so they're roughly the same size uh, France probably has the better economy they usually do uh, Austria on the other hand probably has the better allies because that's the way it works well we'll uh, try to take care of this all these uh god damn it well i guess sieging oman will give us the war score we need even though i would like to i would have liked to have 100 percent by now seeing as i occupy all of the Hmm. Oh yeah, they leave extra cannons behind. Silly. Well, that's the detach siege button is uh, is not intelligent. Well, I guess it is, but uh, not in the way you would want. Uh, it actually leaves uh, so here why did it leave 3,000 3,000 troops <sighs> 72 now we can't really justify keeping him in power uh, at 72 tradition so let's uh, unless we wanted to go for a dictatorship but I'm not sure that would be beneficial that's just something I would like to try out sometime. Let's get a new bureaucrat candidate and let's uh, pay our uh, traders to not lose power like that. We are getting some uh, some work done here. Almost 100% religious unity. That's uh, that's nice as well. Let's see now. Army Let's uh, leave just the two. Let's uh, leave just the two. There we go. Our troops up here. Why? Oh. <laughs> this looks like two provinces. Iraq and Arab. <laughs> So that's why. That's why I was confused. Mm, yeah. So. I don't know. This is gonna take a while. This uh, sieging. Well, it shouldn't take too long, but uh, I was hoping this war would be over by now. But it's not. And that's uh, Hama. Where's Hama? Over there. All right. Happy. Happy for you. Uh, these guys should stop there. Leave behind those two. Send one cannon up there. Like that.
All right, it's the diplomat or spy of France. Well, I've uh, talked about my stance on that mission before, so let's uh, let's just pick the what I think is the right choice. Uh, even though I'm not using my diplomats, uh, I will be soon. I hope fabricating new claims. There we go. Hmm. They are making lots of money. Sixteen ducats a month. Do we have no expenses? What's the matter? Well, Araqua, that's up here. More Syrian nationalists. Well, we are going to release the Syrian Ottoman. So, yeah. Let's, uh... Let's support the peasants. Oh. They are friendly. Ooh. And, uh... Let's, uh... Um, let's see if we can support these uh, Syrian nationalists first, may, for, make them uh, leave the country. Uh, we don't need to support them that much. There we go. Uh, oh yeah, going to the Mamox. Uh, that would be oh that would be so good if they could uh, make uh, the Mamox release Syria again from these provinces. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's uh, stop supporting them. Sieges are going fine. We are having peasants in Izmir. We are going to be supporting those peasants. They will be our friends for seven pennies a month. And they will do something else. If we're lucky, they may, might go... Well, I don't, I don't even... I have no clue what they're up to, what they will do. Maybe they'll, they'll go to Nogai, the the vassal. <laughs> that would be fun. Poor guy. So, we are making gains. 70%. We could, uh, could actually get our peace now, so... Yeah, I guess there's no use... Uh... Well... Synop, let's uh, unclick you and see if we can't. Uh... Oh, Aiden is worth a lot, 31%. <sighs> Do we have a cheap province down here? Yemen. Yemen has a claim on Aiden. Uh, Aiden, two base tax, still. So expensive, 31% war score. No, yeah, for sure, thirty-one percent. Why is that so expensive? Uh, oh well, uh, we could wait, see if we can get uh, uh, one of these uh, provinces. That would be could be useful uh, having a province over here. Let's see, uh, these are all Ooh, Indus, that's, uh, that's interesting, but getting, say we got uh, Hadramaut, well that would be returned to Yemen, or well, we would actually do that, uh, I guess we could well, see, we got this. We could probably get a few looks at the Timurids. Uh, or Muscat. Five. Three. Well, they're gonna be too expensive. But then on the other hand, um, yeah, I'm taking Sin up to get uh, Ottomans out of the way. I guess 99. That means uh, 14 years of truce. Let's 
let's do it. There we go. My overextension is gonna be at 120 freaking percent. But uh, I will be releasing Syria. That's four provinces. Uh, there we go. So that should put them down below. Yeah, 72%. So we have Izmir, Mentis, Karaman. No, Mentis is old. Izmir, Karaman, Sinop, and Dolkadir. So Dolkadir and Sinop. Uh, I guess we could be giving these to Turkish. Turkish. Uh, would you accept that? You would take it. Uh, I don't mind. Uh, would you accept Sinop as well? That's a Turkish Sunni. Probably not, seeing as they would be overextended. Uh, but we can try. Let's uh, keep these for ourselves, though. Izmir. 119.85. Well. Let's see. This actually, if I keep this one, that makes me be, that makes it, sorry, I can't speak. Uh, if I keep Synop, I'll be able to fabricate a claim on everything but Ankara. Uh, so that's an idea, and Adana, I guess, but I already have a claim on Adana. So yeah, we could have could be rid of the Ottomans uh, fairly quickly. Two more wars, and uh, they're gone. Venice, yeah, this is turning out quite all right. Let's see if we can get our. Quran, Badia Shaman, Hasham. Yeah, let's claim those. Uh, actually, we probably don't need to. Oh, yeah, we do. Those two. That one is uh, Syria Core, so that should be easily returned. Let's uh, stop supporting those rebels. <laughs> Release them. Uh, well, they would have attack the Ottomans anyway, even though I supported them. Uh, let's look at our 3.3. Uh, let's do that and let's just core those. And seeing as we have a lot of uh, military power, we could be harsh treatmenting. But the cost is really harsh. 120. It's still gonna be at 6%, so that's not gonna, not gonna be any help. I'm just gonna have to live with uh, those places revolting, I think. Because I don't think 6% is gonna prevent them from revolting. There we go. Oh, that's why we had so much, uh, much money. Uh, yeah, that was uh, quite a war, quite a nice peace deal. Uh, we could begin integrating Byzantium, but we should probably let them core Dolkadir first. Now let's see, oh no, I'm not gonna sell them, sell them that. New trade re research is heretical, so we are losing prestige or diplomatic power. We are losing prestige, obviously. And we have rebels in Sinop already. So, well, if we're lucky, Byzantium will take care of them for us. If we're not, we will lose our uh, corporation, so let's cancel that. Now let's look at our uh, 
Force limit here at 58 of, out of 70. We could for, uh, get a huge fleet of trade ships going. Hmm. I wish I could see this trade node. Oh, so we are trading in coffee. Well, we were trading in coffee, not anymore. Uh, what is the time at? Time is at 30 minutes, according to my count. So let's uh, call this an episode, and uh, we'll see what we will be up to in the next episode. We have truces with Mamluks, Oman, Nogai, and Ottomans, and that's uh, that leaves us Kwarakoyunlu and uh, Timurids to play around with. We'll see if we find something nice to do. I know Kwara Kuyunlu still has one core from uh, Iraq. So that's something to do. Iraq can actually be, be annexed soon as well, so I should uh, improve those relations and I should One thousand three hundred and ninety-five diplo power. Well, that's diplo power instead of uh, core creation, so I guess it's uh, it's a good thing. Hmm. Well, they are still useful fighting the Ottomans, uh, so let's keep them there. These small ones are mostly for coring, though. I'm at 6 out of 6. I, s I know I said I would end this episode, but you know me. Uh, yeah, well, anyway, uh, next episode we'll try to complete our Iraq collection and um, yeah, allied with Oman. <laughs> cool. Uh, yeah, and uh, thank you for watching. Uh, click the like, click the subscribe. Uh, Click the post comment and uh, I'll see you in the next episode. So long.